Education is not about just going to school. Education is about intellectual curiosity. Most people are educated, but they don't question. In Africa, Pastor, they tell us it's that when, like you question, not allowed. when you question <laughs> anything, they, they tell you you're being disrespectful. They say you're being rebellious. Yeah, they say you're rude. They will say you're being a talkative. They will say you're being, you're being petulant. They will try to silence you. So somebody needs to share this message, and somebody needs to tweet this out. Education is not about going to school. Education is about the act of questioning. It's about the act of querying things that you don't understand instead of just saying, well, we're going to just leave it to the gods or it's more powerful <laughs> than we are. So, Pastor, I just had to interject there. So, let's go to the second point, please. Yes. Uh, the second point, what it means to be educated, is the ability to know. If you go to true school, either medicine or whatever, or philosophy, or what, it doesn't matter what your study is, anything you study, even primary, secondary school, if you go through school, you are not taught, number one, quite the art of questioning, which is uh, intellectual curiosity. Number two thing you must be taught to, for you to know you are educated. Only these people are educated that know and have been taught that the outlook to the world must be based on cause and effect. Hmm. So no matter what you study and no matter the degree you have, if your outlook, if you have not been, if you have not been taught in worldview, and your worldview and outlook at life is not based on the principle of cause and effect, then you didn't go to school. You are not educated. Mm -hmm. You have gone to the school, you got certificate, but you are not educated. You are still you, superstitious. Yes, and you are a servant of, you become a servant of your, el the elements around you. Mm -hmm. You become a servant and a slave to the system mm -hmm. instead of you to be able to rule over the system. Mm -hmm. So that is number two. So please tweet that out as well. Education is your ability not just to be able to read books, but to be able to <laughs> understand them. <laughs> Many people just go to school and they come out with certificates. Certificates <laughs> don't make you educated. Tell cause somebody. It's about cause and effect. It's about cause and effect. If you're able to describe what caused something and how it brought about an effect, then you can call yourself an educated person. When you can look at the situation and go to the root of it and then come out with an outcome and then describe an outcome and then describe solutions, that is what, that is what education means. And I, and I discovered that in North America and Europe, that's that the way the most basis. of them yes, are. Yes, that's the way they are. And that is why most of the religious folks from Africa find it difficult to blend into society. And they cannot convert them. Yeah, they cannot convert <laughs> them. So it's like, and that's why most of them are atheists and they yes. make fun of us as yes. Africans. Yes. Because we don't believe in cause and effect. We, we always want to believe in the supernatural. We cling to the supernatural superstition. and superstitions. We always want to cling to the things that we, be, we were told by our grandparents as opposed to what we were told by our teachers. In superstitions. fact, superstitions hold more power than, our, than, than, our, cause, and than cause and effect than our educational system. Or the evidence of our eyes. Yeah, so please tweet that out and invite somebody. Because we're, 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 we're liberating Africa. If we're going to build a new, con a, a new continent, if we're going to become a continent of light, not a continent of darkness, we're, we're going to have to rely on cause and effect. We're going to have to be able to question everything and come up with viable solutions. Gone are the days where people will say, keep quiet. The era of keeping quiet has come to an end. It's now a new era of questioning. It's now a new era of cause and effect.